we believe in fairs and uh, we of course do international fairs but also local fairs. The biggest challenge is uh, the different uh, budgets. It is a big decision to participate in these kinds of events. We need to, we want to meet people that are using our products. We actually do it quite a lot and uh, we of course do international fairs but also local fairs as this is. Uh, we are a part of a bigger cluster of a Nordic operation so we also travel cross-border to, uh, to um, go to other fairs. We are doing both. So we are participating in local fairs because uh, we, are, we are getting uh, you can say it's a more relaxed atmosphere maybe. We are meeting the customer face to face, uh, again back to the locally uh, perspective of it uh, and, sh and showing we are there and uh, want to take our time out and, and, uh, and, and discuss these uh, technologies. Well of course the international fairs like Drupal and FESPA is really important for Canon Denmark as well. And this, this is a big part of our, our daily business going to these kinds of fairs. So, uh, so that is equally important I would say. I believe we, we need to bo uh, do both. Uh, uh, that's, that's very, uh, very um, important. Of course. I would say a local fair is uh, it's not so big. Uh, it's of course only more or less only Danish people are coming, maybe someone from Sweden, so we can do it on a local language, it, it always helps. <laughs> um, also, we have the opportunity to uh, build our own stands so we can present our local solutions and present uh, Canon Denmark as we want to present Canon Denmark towards the graphics uh, arts industry. To, to be presented in a local fair, it's a great opportunity for Rico. Um, we have the chance here to, uh, to talk about uh, the, the, the new technologies we have, uh, also sharing our knowledge, but uh, most of all uh, connect to the customers in, uh, in, a, in a local uh, scale. So that's very, very important for us. One of the main differences is uh, that we are connecting on a, on a different level with our customers. Uh, the, the best way to say it is our feet are planted solid on the ground, looking at the customers um, in the eyes and listening to their stories, uh, hearing about their applications and also have a discussion around where the market is moving and, and, and yeah, in overall have a good, uh, have a good uh, discussion uh, with them. And um, that's, that's a difference from the big, the big fair events uh, globally, internationally uh, and, and the locals. We think, in general, it's very, very important to keep uh, uh, the business in Denmark, uh, in specific areas, uh, going. And we think it's very important to support these kind of fairs. We think it's important to meet not only our resellers, but also our end customers, the people who are actually using the products. Uh, and we only do that by being at the fairs where the customers are. We need to. We want to meet people that are using our products. There are not that many local fairs left here in, in Denmark. Uh, Sign and Print is more or less uh, the only one who, that is truly uh, for the graphic arts market. Uh, and we, are, we have been participating in the Sign and Print as long as it, uh, it, it has been around. So it's uh, once every year. That's, that's our main event. Um, that's, that's how often we are participating. It is expensive. It is, it is a big decision to participate in these kinds of events. Uh, you can say advertising, uh, direct mails, one-to-one uh, uh, -one meetings is also really important. And it's, it's always something you have to consider uh, whether or not it's, it's worth it. But we think sign and print is a good investment. Uh, it, it, it gives us the opportunity to present our solutions in a different way than we can do in our showroom or when we bring customers to, uh, to other Canon events. And it gives us an opportunity to meet uh, new, new customers that we don't come into contact with uh, on a daily basis. Plus it gives the Danish uh, market a, a, a way of growing. So it's, it's not only presenting for, for the local, solution, uh, local vendors, but also 
we have seminars, uh, other kinds of, 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 of events that are inspiring the business as a whole. So I think that's, that's a big part as well. We have a 60 square meters uh, stand at the at the sign and print fair, and we will uh, we are, have split our stand up in, in two parts. So we are an A4 A3 part, you can say, and we have uh, our dis district uh, graphic division as well. So we will be 60 six to eight people at at the stand. We are expecting five people to be at at the stand, so to work with our products. We will be uh, 10 people in uh, sign and print uh, this year. We will also have one guy joining from Epson Europe, uh, being a, a technician. So uh, with technical products, we need to be ready for customers asking really technical, difficult questions. Uh, so we need all the expertise we can get. We are right now, with the sign and print, we are introducing 3D printing in Denmark. Uh, which is uh, quite a big deal for us and uh, for the Danish market, we think. And uh, we have, luckily, we have uh, someone from Canon Europe uh, joining us for this, so they will help us to present 3D printing in, at the Sign and Print Fair. The more questions, the better. Uh, if we get a lot of these kind of questions, uh, we are most likely to have a success than if no questions is asked. Right now we are situated in our demo room in our Danish head office uh, where we tend to have uh, small micro exhibitions uh, where we invite partners, uh, our products don't stand alone. So we invite a lot of people to come and make work sessions and invite uh, end customers. Uh, we have uh, seminars, we have, uh, of course, we have uh, demonstrations when we are presenting cases for customers and uh, we have also social events, so we use our uh, local showroom a lot. We also use uh, the different showrooms and the different, uh, different facilities that we have around Europe to bring customers uh, to as well, so, um, so we have a lot, of, a lot of opportunities. But of course, on, if we look at all product areas, I would assume that we have around 10 fairs uh, in the Danish market a year. Um, so it's definitely something we are spending a lot of time and effort in. We all always have um, um, RICO um, from, from other countries uh, presented on the fair because uh, we are a part of a bigger uh, Nordic operation and, uh, and of course they will fly in and, uh, and uh, anticipate in, in these uh, events. We had like uh, three last year and we'll do so also this year. Of course, the, the biggest challenge is the, the different uh, budgets. Um, and also when we are at international fairs, uh, we are not sure that as many Danish end users will actually join the fair. So by having a local fire, we are sure that the people we're meeting is actually the customer of ours in the Danish and, in this case, also Scandinavian market, because it is really the biggest fair in, in Scandinavia for this area. So we see a lot of our, our neighbor countries joining as well. We have already launched, 3D print is now launched in, in the UK and here in Q4 it will be launched in the Nordic countries. Uh, so this is, this is uh, quite a good opportunity for us and timing wise it's, it's quite good. We won't bring a printer to the, th uh, to the sign and print because we have a small uh, stand and it's a rather small fair. But we, we will show a lot of interesting um, uh, samples from, from, th from the 3D print world. And, and through that we can inspire our customers to see what they can do with, with uh, 3D print and, and which steps they can take in their business uh, towards 3D print. I think it's very, very hard to uh, prepare for all the questions, all the situations, all the cases that you might meet, meet uh, which is actually forcing uh, the people that are at the stand to be at their absolute best uh, moment to be ready uh, and to 
to meet people, to, to help people and uh, find the, the answers to their questions. Of course, 3D print will be uh, one of our key uh, focus areas at, at the fair, but we will also present uh, new solutions uh, uh, that could help our customers both to get more business, but also uh, help them to, to uh, be more efficient in their daily work. Uh, this particular one is for our large format printers, um, which is a quite technical fair. Um, only one fair year in this specific area. We will use the fair to, uh, of course, use some products that are already in the market, but at the same time, we will also use it to have a launch of a, a new product group, uh, a series called the P-Series, um, which is a series in different sizes and in different colors. But it's a series that is uh, designed to proof printing uh, with a very, very uh, large uh, color space. So, in fact, we have products going up to covering 99% of the uh, Pantone uh, color scheme, so which is uh, the highest in the market. So we're looking very much forward to, to launching that or that product series. We have a lot of interesting things to show in, uh, in Odense. Uh, we have uh, new technology in the market, uh, new equipment, as you can see behind us. And we will also show other uh, printing solutions, both in uh, white format and in uh, in normal printing. And, uh, and we really look forward to, to, to talk about uh, print to itch, uh, to, uh, to uh, go for the fifth color station. Uh, we have a lot of new ways where our customers can develop their business uh, in, in new ways uh, they haven't seen before. Um, that is what it's all about, uh, improving their businesses. It is really the biggest fair in, in Scandinavia for this area. So we see a lot of our, our neighbor countries joining as well. We will be showing um, products in different segments. So we have a lot of uh, technical products. So we have a product uh, standing uh, left to me here, a production printer for outdoor signage, uh, different uh, POS materials. We will also be showing products with uh, sublimation uh, colors uh, into textile printing and indoor signage of different types. So we will have a, a wide spectrum of, of products within the limited area we will have at the stand, trying to show as much as, as possible. So uh, we will have uh, a really good um, stand. I'm, I'm, I'm sure we'll have great success at the Simon Print.